tonight's Star Supercard and text MA reading this right. An extra match has been added on top of the two title matches we already got slated. You read it correctly, Sir Wallace. In addition to our double main event with the two title matches, if as if it weren't enough, we are going to add on to that a 30 woman battle royal. How about that right there, gentlemen? Wait, so with just an email between you and Colin O'Toole, you guys are signing volunteers right now. While we're talking, that's some pretty on the fly GM work that. I'm sure there's no shortage of volunteers either. Uh, well, more on that story as the plot thickens later on. Right now, it's time for the RWL King of Legends Championship match between Ox Baker and the Mexican monolith himself, Warlord Sandler. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Heritage Undisputed Prestigious Championship! Heavyweight Championship and the World Heavyweight Championship all reside with this man, the Triple Crown King of the Monsters, the Mexican Monolith Warlord. Santos, who, by the way, will be enjoying home field advantage here tonight, where Santos cut his in-ring teeth under a mask as El Gigante Psychotico way before he ever came to our WL and checked him. Now, so heavy with gold that Freddy Blassie secured Santos a ride to the ring. Talk about traveling in style. It's like they used to say in the old commercials, Johnny. Membership has its privileges. And when you're a member of the Triple Crown Club around here, hey, hey, you got perks. Still, it must be nice to not have to take a long walk to the ring before the match, especially at like 496 pounds. This fella has been just a beast since last year, snagging two of his three titles in rapid succession. And the King of Legends belt the one at stake here. Well, this will be Santos' first defense. If he's anything like he is with the Super Heavy, the World Heavyweight Championship, you know, super possessive. Ox Baker could be in for a rough night. Von Ams Regis ad mortem. Wow, my Latin is a little rusty, but I think it means, as with Vaughn, all kings must die. What a weird slogan for a championship belt. A challenger from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 310 pounds, Oxley Baker! And his opponent, from Gomez Palacio, Durango, Mexico, weighing in at 496 pounds, the Heritage Undisputed Prestigious Champion and the Super Heavyweight Champion, the Giant War Santos! Well, the Mexican monolith has beaten some of the biggest, the best and the best. Uh, Oz Baker, like 
you said, Johnny, could be in for a bit of a rough night. Huh. All right, Will. The belt is being shown to Ox Baker. Maybe he's only looking at it this evening. Who knows? I go home with it. Nobody can see. But anyhow, the time has come. King of Legends title on the line and everything. This is gonna be exciting. All right. Bell sounds. They come in a ring, they lock it up. Santos whips Ox Baker into the corner. Whoa, whoa, hold him out of the corner. Has him all the way up, slams him down to the mat. Huh. Yeah, the Mexican monolith is a powerhouse and a half. Huh. He's got Ox Baker whipped him back into the corner again and repeated it. Liked it so much he thought he'd do it again. Thought it was so nice he'd do it twice. Slams Ox Baker down to the mat and said, Oh my god, Jesus. Well, not used to seeing Ox Baker get knocked around quite like this. The uh, streets is a treat. It's something special. You never get to see it. So enjoy it while you can. <laughs> wow. Ox Baker with that military press drop. Bad Ox, hey, little goes for a cover right away here. One, just a one. At 57 seconds, I'm not surprised. Well, up the ropes into a big old splash. And Ox Baker decides he's safer on the outside. And he might well be. For a moment. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, quick counter from the Ox. That could have gone a whole lot worse. Oh, it just got worse. Oh, man. Zero offense, he has not done a damn thing. And, oh, man. Like Santos is just practicing with a dummy or something. Gee. Huh. I expected a whole hell of a lot more from the great heart punch specialist, Ox Baker, but, uh, oh, man. Santos was teeing off on the man. And, uh, wow. This is just brutal here. Hey, Ox Baker. Santos back inside the ring. Well, he guess he realizes now he ain't safe nowhere. Better go face the music. Oh, shoulder tackle from the Mexican models. Mm -hmm. A big bad triple crowner. Locks it up with the ox. And bangs him into the turnbuckle and just chucks him aside. Santos on the mat for the first time here. Beautiful splash. Nails it, hooks the leg here, goes for the pin, but uh, just about a one and a quarter. Huh. All right, they lock it up again. Ox whips Santos to the ropes. Big boot takes the Mexican monolith down. Santos wisely going for another cover, but just a one. Yeah, gonna have to work a whole lot harder, Ox. He might be back in control of the situation here. Oh, Dale Santos with the DDT and the Wiz back there playing around with them turnbuckles again. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, the managers around here, they just uh, they just don't care. Uh, it's unbelievable. We just can't stop them. <laughs> we find them, we suspend them and everything, but nothing seems to work. So, well, we're on the outside here in Hot Speaker. Going to town. Well, it was going to town. Mexican monolith. Now has Ox Baker up. Oh, man. Just slammed it. Flip slammed it. Huh. Mexican monolith. Just daring the audience to try and stop him. Oh, man. Whoa. Nails him with a discus punch. Well, by my calculations, Ox Baker had approximately 15 seconds of offense. Let's, let's give him that and not take it away from him. <laughs> All right, Santos with another big splash here. And, uh, yeah, Ox 
not doing as well as he normally would. Oh, all the way up. Oh, and he is holding on to this one. He's gonna, he's gonna savor the moment right here. And down he goes. Man, beautiful stalling vertical suplex from the Mexican monolith. Now Santos up there on that top rope. And that's that old man, beautiful splash. Goes for the cover again here. One, two, three, and that is all she wrote, kids. Warlord Santos retains the King of Legends title. Here is your winner, and still heritage, undisputed, prestigious champion, the Giant Warlord Santos. You know what, guys? Every time Warlord Santos wins a match like that, Freddie Blatz, he just gotta be with right. I mean, Santos has gotta be the most successful champion Blatz has managed in a long, long time. They say it's not bragging if you can back it up. And hey, our WL has three triple crown champions, Santos, Danielle, and Patty Powers, all at the same time. That's pretty damn amazing, if you ask me. That was more in a moment, so stick around.